Hello friends, welcome to part 62 of my Horizon Zero Dawn full blind playthrough on the PlayStation 5. Uh, we are playing on Ultra Difficulty and this is the Frozen Wilds DLC. So today we're going to do the sh uh, Shaman or Shaman, I don't know how to pronounce that properly, uh, Shaman's Path. we got to find a person called Nell Took and optional it says, but I will talk to him, talk to Aratak. So we'll do that. Cutscene in the last episode was really badass. I like the animations as well when you're speaking to somebody. It's it's pretty awesome, guys. It's definitely um, an improvement. And guys, this thing fascinates me. It's incredible. <laughs> anyway, so I'm very excited. There's going to be a lot to do. And guys, check out the size of the map as well. Look at that. We've got a tall neck as well, which is great. So it's a very big area. Uh, there seems to be a settlement here as well. Another side quest by the looks of it. All right, but for now, where's Aratak? Who is... Aratak's him. Okay, let's talk to him. Right, we just spoke to this dude here. Uh, Burgundy, I think his name is. I can't remember. But um, he was pretty awesome. All right, let's see what this is. I do not want to hear this talk from you again. Doubt is heavier than a week's snow. Forgive me, my chieftain. We will be ready for the next attempt. But this will not be an attempt. It must be done. Do you understand? My chieftain. Good. Outlander, I suppose you wish to speak. Oh, uh, well, where do I start? <laughs> All right, let's start here. There are other wear acts in Song's Edge, too. Yes, the village has its own life for all Banuk who need trade or shelter. After the war ended, it sprang up from what was once a campsite, quick as the bloom between frosts. Perhaps it will last until the Karja seek war again. Right, Aurea. We keep hearing this name, Aurea. Aurea knows about this, Damon. Where would I talk to her? She does a shaman's work. That is not for the eyes and ears of others. Certainly not an Outlander's. Grumpy. <laughs> right, the daemon. This daemon you talked about. If you are hardy enough, you can venture out and see the signs yourself. It has changed the machines, made them fiercer and stronger. But what is it? A matter for the shamans to debate. Shamans. Okay. Your Warak. Did your Warak come from this place? No, he rallied most of our hunters from across Banyur to face the threat of the daemon. But I was born here and stayed to fight the Karja when others retreated into the mountains. A few of my old warriors remain with me, those who survived. Okay, the Expedition of Thunder's Drum. You're set on going back to the mountain? I have put my word to it. Even with the risks being so great? The risk of what? Death? It would be a worse fate to bow our heads to the challenge and say too much wow that's a great quote actually all right farewell well i guess that's it then good i prefer deeds to words right spent her time i'm not sure about him yet he's very grumpy <laughs> okay um just having a look guys and i will go and find naltuk and if you remember the uh, last episode guys um, I did go to a merchant and he's highlighted in a blue color and he's got some sick weapons and co uh, outfits. I, I cannot wait to get hold of him, but we need something called blue gleam and I have no idea what the heck that is. Right, where's this mountain? So that's obviously a volcano, but I don't remember a volcano being in, in the States, in the United States. Guys, there's a lot to do, a lot to explore. All right, so let's go up this way. I did see some of the ex. Sorry, I'm looking for some of the exclamation mark. I tell you, I'm not going to do it, but I just want to open this up. Well, I hope it doesn't lock me into an actual quest. Right, who were you? You seem sad, stranger. I heard you mention a flood. Yes. A sudden deluge, without rain or melt to explain it. I'm Lalai, 
the drummer of Deep Din. Or at least I was, until it disappeared under the waters. Deep Din? What's that? A hollow, carved out by the old ones. A chamber, a basin, and a musical instrument all at once. My life, my calling. I'd explain it by playing for you if I could. But its pipes are deep under the water now. So Deep Din is a place and a musical instrument? Yes. Pipes that carry a perfect tone beneath a sonorous basin. A wondrous edifice the old ones used to carry music far and wide. During the war, my father played the pipes to rally the Banuk against the Karja. I'm the drummer now. But our battles are few and far between. Mostly I play for the joy of it. Or to remember my family. Of course, if the waters don't recede, what's the point of joy? Or remembering. Oh, I actually want to help her now. <laughs> So the waters came fast. One day it was dry. The next, the nearby river had risen and the entire basin was flooded. I don't understand it. There was no rain, not even any clouds, and yet the river rose higher than I'd ever seen it. And there it remains. All right, guys. So this will open up, obviously, a side quest. We won't do that today. We'll do it much later on. A flood without rain. That is strange. Where is this place? I'll have a look if I'm in the area. Just northwest of here. Look all you like, but I don't see what good it'll do. The floodwaters aren't going anywhere. How does one ask a river to relent? Waterlogged. Okay, cool. All right, so anyway, go back to this one now. Um, final took. This way, I guess. I heard of a shaman once. Okay, if I want to learn more about how this daemon affects the machines, I've got to find Rhea. And to do that, I need to talk to her apprentice, who followed the river north. Alright, cool. Oh, there's another thing here. <laughs> uh, guys, we'll speak to him later on, it's fine. I don't want to get distracted. The hell is that? A goat! All right, we've got goats in this game. That's great. All right, awesome. There's a boar as well. Is there anything new? Anything else new, I mean? A badger, are you kidding, guys? Turkey as always. Um, What else, what else? What is that? Charge. <laughs> All right, let's, let's kill a goat. Oh, wow, he's still alive. Oh, you piece of shit. <laughs> God damn it. Where is he? Oh, guys, you've got to be kidding me. Wait, what was that? Something went up the um, thing. And is that an owl? Did you hear that? It is an owl, guys. Look, check it out. Can you scan, please? It is an owl. That is that is awesome. So there are more animals that survived, which is great. Okay, guys, I'm getting distracted. Let, let's just go. <laughs> All right. So where does it want me to go? This way? Okay, we're not too far now. Well, there's another bird. There's probably another owl, perhaps. What's this? Oh, there you are. Oh, jeez. One sec. Thing is, we may need uh, skins or whatever uh, for the new costumes. Not costumes, the outfits. Let's just kill one more. And what about Badger? No! <laughs> God damn, I was trying to mark it. Alright. Badger bones. See, we might need them, so why not? Okay.
Any news from the hunt? The herd isn't roaming far from the camp. <sighs> Keeping together this time. Then we wait. But I bet we'll see a stray. All right, I'll keep watch tonight. Very nice here, guys, I gotta say. Campfire discovered. What do you mean? Is there a town here or something? Dora, we're gonna move on. I just wanna do a quick save. Where? Okay. Carja, what are you doing here? May the sun grant you a. Uh a portion of its wisdom young huntress what what brings you Karja so far from your home there's good machine hunting in the cut danger too some have a taste for both and they pay people like me well to guide them we've had a bad run this time even after i brought this priest along to read the signs i did say the sun's light was cast quite red the night of the not your concern though huntress may your arrows find their mark <laughs> okay guys these things i don't know what you, what you call them we, uh, do we have them in the uk it's like a barbecue <laughs> thing i see them on um like instagram and stuff grill master or something but anyway let's keep going where the hell are we going Sorry, guys. I'm just enjoying myself. I hope you guys understand. It's all new to me, this area. I'm just excited to be in a new area, and I kind of just want to explore everything. No, don't run away. <laughs> Give me a skin. God damn it. All right, whatever. Ugh, you live for now, goat. <laughs> I've got things to do. That must be Naltuk looking out of that tower. What tower? Looks like it's sending out a pulse for signal. What the hell is that? Oh shit, machines. Alright, let's talk. Wait, wait, let me let me scan this. Interesting. Maybe I could override it. Oh, okay. I saw a weak spot come out, but anyway, um, PSI overrides, repairs, and provides shock resistance to hostile machines. Stuns overridden machines. All right, interesting. Okay, override points. Yeah, that's fine. A self-explanatory. Cool. Right, that's a weak spot. Um, repairs and provides shock resistance. Oh, no, we've read that already. Okay. Oh, gosh. <laughs> All right, here we go. Let's speak to Nal2. Naltuk? Who are you? How did you find me? Bergrind told me you'd be out here. He's persistent. I've told that Asaram a thousand times. I don't need to buy anything. And I'm not selling. I just need to find Araya. Well, you won't. She's gone where only shamans can tread. She seeks guidance from the voice in the blue light. That is her task. And the task she gave me is to observe the daemon's work. To stop it spreading, if I can. What can I do about these towers? In only a few weeks, they've sprouted throughout the cut. The demon's energy pulses from them, rallies the machines, even repairs them. What? So they get healed? Aratok said this demon was frenzying machines. Look there, those with the purple markings. They belong to the demon. Stronger, more dangerous. I've seen something like this before. A corruption. But it wasn't from your daemon. You have? Well, then you know more than I do. Are these towers, were they part of your corruption? No. Those are new to me, too. Like I said, they empower the daemon's machines. They must be stopped. Will you tell me where Aurea went? You ask a lot of questions. Only when I'm not getting the answers I need. There's but one voice Soraya wants to hear right now, and it isn't yours. I'm sorry. Right, so let's spread... So, sorry, let's stop the spread. All right, you want to stop the spread of the Daemon's work? I know how to get started. With my 
Bow and spear. Outlander, wait. Won't you tell me your name? Aloy. Good. If you fall to the Daemon's machines, at least I can properly recount your efforts to Araya. Thanks for the vote of confidence. <laughs> but I won't fall. And when I'm done, you're gonna tell me where she is. Guys, one more thing I need to check. I don't think we can override these things, can we? Um, I think it's this. Right, okay, it's a good thing I double check. Override, impossible. So if they're Damon, or whatever it is, then we can't override them. That sucks. All right, fine. Can I just shoot that thing from here? I'm so nervous, guys. All right, all right. So we got a long leg. Um, what else? There's some more machines up there. Scrap. Oh, great scrap! It's god damn it. Okay, there's another one there as well. Another one here. Actually, guys, let me switch into my stealth. Okay, so so far, one, two, one, two, three. And a long leg. Okay. Now, if these things keep getting healed, it'll be in my best interest to get rid of this. Guys, it's so cool, though. I gotta admit. All right. Okay, I'm gonna try and override it. If this doesn't work. Oh, no, 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 please. Quick, quick. <laughs> Damn it. I should have planned this a bit better. Okay, oh, crap. Let's see if this thing can work for me. Oh, he's shot. Okay, good. Oh, God, damn it. I need to highlight it. Nice. <laughs> right, that worked out. However, don't want to get cocky, though. Okay, there's one here. Oh, come on. Seriously? Oh my god, seriously, dude. He died. How? Okay, I can hear the long leg. He's right behind me. Okay. Right, let me triple up a shot. Let's try and get that chest. Oh, crap. <laughs> no, move, move. Okay. Actually, guys, I barely ever use my sticky bombs. Let me try on him. Good. Well, hey, that didn't work out too badly. <laughs> it wasn't too bad. All right, anyway. But I could have shot it as well, see? I'm ready. Gotta be. Okay, <laughs> not bad. I've got some XP as well. All right, what else is there? Let's grab that. Grab that. Okay, let me just loot these guys quickly. Right, now, Took, where are you? Let's talk about Araya. Oh, now you want to talk. <laughs> I think he's impressed. Need them soon enough. Seems I can take care of the machines and towers. The daemon's next. You claimed its power for yourself somehow. Perhaps Aurea should meet you after all. What she truly seeks is hope. After what I just saw, you could show her that. 
She's in retreat beyond those mountains, the ice rasps. You'll have oh, to walk shit. the shaman's path to get there. You'll know you've reached the end when you come to a shrine, a great machine covered in blue gleam. Shamans who complete the path take a piece of it as reward. If you make it that far, you should too. You'll have earned it. Right, blue gleam. I need to know more about this. You said something about blue gleam at the end of the shaman's path? crystal that builds on the bodies of machines in the oldest ice. We Banuk believe it's the stuff of the blue light, frozen as it escapes their shells. You might be more interested that merchants will trade well for it. Yes. Bergen told me you're Araya's apprentice. In her absence, I serve the chieftain and his Werak as an advisor, a scout, a speaker for the blue light. A lot of responsibilities. I don't know if I can live up to Araya's example, but I have to try. I owe her that much. She took a chance on me. An aspiring shaman from the edge of the world. No one else would. Were you with Aurea when they attacked the mountain? I wish I had been, even with all that happened. I'm no warrior, though, so she bid me wait. When Aurea and the chieftain returned, I saw them argue bitterly. I don't know what about exactly. Then she came to me, gave me my task, and left us. So they don't really like each other, um, Araya and that, uh, what's his name, Ar Aratak? Anyway, the Shaman's Path. How do I cross this Shaman's Path? Go to the Ice Rasps. Then follow the markers through the ice caves and the waterfalls, and make the climb to the shrine. But be careful. The path is meant to be an ordeal, the final trial of a young Shaman's training. And I'll find Araya at the end of it? No. She goes further up, somewhere inside the mountain. If you see her, would you tell her? I have faith she will hear the voice again. What voice? All right, guys, let's do that. What the hell? <laughs> guys, he just took off. Okay, um, how far? Oh, I really want this tall neck, though. Uh, no, let's... Yeah, I'm committed now. I may as well stick to this. Next episode or the episode afterwards, we're going to do, um, you know, probably a tall neck. Now, remember, guys, although I'm in Frozen Wilds, quite possibly the next episode, I'll be back in the main uh, base game to do maybe a bandit camp or a side quest because we're still trying to get as much done before I do Looming Shadow. And that obviously includes trying to, you know, complete this DLC as well. Right, let's grab some more medicine. Alright, where to now? What's this? Wait, hold, wait, wait, there's a data point. Sorry guys, it's on the uh, mini-map. I just saw it. Oh, here it is, check it out. Return to Singapore. Okay. Hey, guys, that's awesome. That's our first Frozen Wilds data point. Okay. Return to Singapore. As the waters recede, the people return. Singapore, May 5th, 2043. A large pink tinted rock marks the summit of Bukit Timah Hill, Singapore's highest point. At one time, 164 meters above sea level. Charmaine Low records a self-hollow next to the rock. Her bright smile contradicted by nervous fidgeting with her prismatic fake nails and 30s-style subdermal jewellery. I thought I'd never see this place again. I still can't believe it's real, she marvels. Proud Bukit Timmer has stood firm against uh, time and weather, but the rest of Singapore has fared less well. With approximately... A third of the island nation at less than five meters above sea level. Singaporeans like Charmaine were forced to abandon their homes as in inexorable in wait inexorable <laughs> waters leached away their foundations throughout the snoring twenties. What the hell? Now the surviving members of Charmaine's family are returning, alongside many others. As global temperatures and sea level stabilize, people come by air or by water. Some seek refuge from the 
deleterious. <laughs> Guys, I swear this game has words I've never heard of before. But anyway, effects of the Cy Cytorum River tragedy, whose costs still reverberate today. All hope to build new lives atop the collapse of the once stable and prosperous country. Singapore represents one of many states abandoned by their citizens in the aftermath of heavy coastal flooding. Questions surrounding ownership are difficult to answer. Government and law enforcement personnel fled far in advance of the country's devastation, and documentation of title is scattered at best. The plot of land on which Charmaine's childhood home once sat had belonged to the Lowe family for almost a data corrupted. All right, awesome. Just see where we are on the map. Uh, there's that. Do I want to... Oh, it's a little bit far, though. Oh, we'll be fine. No, there's one here. Okay, it's fine. But anyway, that's our first data point in Frozen Worlds. Awesome. These mountains must be the right All right, guys, I need to see this merchant real quick. Again, I just want to know what he's selling and how many blue gleams we need. So I would want to get this first. Or even perhaps that. Look, don't get me wrong. I do love this sword bow, uh, but I use it mainly for corruption, you know, frost, arrows, etc. But I don't use it that often. It's these two I'll be using. So I need about, <laughs> well, 30 blue gleams. Hmm... Oh, wait, guys, guys, guys. Oh, he does sell it, guys. Check it out. Oh, my God. Sorry. I had the suspicion maybe he might sell maps, and he does. So, what's this? Animal figurines. Uh, obviously, I'm not going to have it on ultra hard when I purchase things. It's going to be much cheaper. But we need badger bone, goat bone, pigments. I don't know what this is, guys. Okay, I want this. I'm more interested in this one. So that'll be five goat skins. God damn it. Uh, badger bones and obviously it won't be 2,500 shards. It'll be much cheaper than that. But that's all good. At least I know what to aim for. Okie dokie. Right, let's go. But that, that's excellent that we've got some um, uh, maps as well. All right, is there any enemies here? All right, so far, no. And guys, just one quick observation as well. You know these paintings on rocks and everything? That is typical of Banuke. If you guys remember... We've got Banuk figurines, which I still haven't collected all of uh, all of yet. But um, if you go up the mountains, it always has so those beautiful Banuk paintings. I think that's really cool. There you go. See, case in point. Look, check it out. That is so cool, guys. Anyway, all right, I'll stop gushing over <laughs> the fact this is a new DLC. What's in here? All right, nothing. So it wants me to go up this way. All right, no enemies. Not yet, <laughs> not yet anyway. Where's the campfire? Okay, here we go, guys. All right, guys, here we go. I'm pretty far up. The shaman's path must be around here somewhere. This must be one of the markers Naltuk told me about. Right, activate the ritualistic marker optional. Okay. Looks like each marker points to another. 
Giving directions. Right, obviously it's telling me to go there. However, let's have a look at this. See if there's anything here. Wrong way. I know. But I'm looking for collectibles, Aloy. Eh, <laughs> Data points, etc. Alright, there's another one of these things. Pretty cool though, I like it. into the cold, creepy ice cave. <laughs> Come on, Aloy. A little bit of uh, optimism. Because <laughs> I am nervous. I'm not going to lie, guys. Check it out. Way out. Some gear, though. All right, here we go. Oh, what's this? Yep, focus can pick up the chimes. Should help me find my way. Wait, let me read that again. Sorry. Machine parts, wire, metal fragments, arranged as bells. Okay. What is that for? What's this chime for? To help guide the way with sound? If there's more, maybe my focus can find them. Okay, supply crate. All right, give me a sec. Sorry, I'm, sorry, I'm quiet, guys. I'm just just listening out for enemies and i swear i can hear stalkers look i've got very sensitive earphones uh headphones sorry and um i'm picking up that low rumbling sound that stalkers make maybe it's in my head maybe i'm imagining things but i don't think i am anyway just before i go here what's up here what's this This is where we were. Right? Oh crap, I've gone too far. Right, guys, I'm going to turn back because I think this is actually where we progress. I don't want to miss anything. Good. Right, I, I get it. Okay, this is actually where we progress. I'm going to skip ahead. You're going to find me uh, down below. All right, guys, I don't think there was actually anything here, to be honest. I think it was just that one supply box. So I don't think we're missing out on anything, but what's this? Okay, that's where I need to go. I'm sorry, I'm just trying to... Right, that's where we started, right? Yeah, it is. Okay, cool. Yeah, I'm getting a little bit lost here. <laughs> okay, let's go back up here then. So this is where we progress by the looks of it. All right, here we go. But guys, I'm not crazy. I swear I heard stalkers. They're not quite here, but they're in the distance. Okay, Aloy said there was another one of those marker things. And it's there. Okay, good. But just quickly, what's here? What's this? Right, supply box. After I grab this loot. All right, here we go. What's this? Oh, nothing. Okay. okay. Which way? That way then. Here, yeah? So what's this? Nothing. Okay, cool.
Guys, there's stalkers here. I'm not going crazy. There is stalkers here. I can hear them. It's almost like a purring sound they make. This way. <laughs> I'm so nervous. Jesus. Guys, that's 100% stalkers. Right, what's up here, though? See, can you hear it? Demonic. <laughs> okay, okay. All right, we need to be careful. I think it's just... No, I don't want to say there's just one. And there ends up being like three or four of them. Money. Another one. There's another one, guys. All right, what's here? <laughs> I'm so scared. All right, so much tension. Oh, you mean okay? This wasn't anything except for supply crate. Okay, guys, let's just face it. Let's just face it. I think I'm going to put some... No, what do you... Oh, whoa, is this a... What is this? I didn't actually mean to go up here, guys. <laughs> Crap, I'm lost. Okay, what's this? Better be careful. All right. Okay, guys. i tell you what we'll do. Let me put this on. This is for their long-ranged attacks. Okay, give me a sec. Let's just see what we're working with first. Okay, all I want to do is remove their... And we could put some proximity bombs. Damn it, not now. One sec. Is any there? Wait, why is he? Did he see me? Oh, you're kidding, guys. Seriously. There's another one to my right. I can hear it. I can't see it, though. Okay. Oh, God damn you. <laughs> All right, there is one here. Oh, shit. No, 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 no. God damn it. I don't have that freaking skill. <laughs> shit. I got something else. Wait, is he trying to cut me off? Oh, shit, guys. Okay. Oh, shit. Okay, okay. Is he coming here? Okay. Where the hell are you? God damn it, man. Great. Wonderful. All right. Good, good, good. Shit. Oh my God, leave me alone. Jesus. Okay. Shit! I'm always out of freaking ammo. God damn it, man. All right, he's all right. He's uh, it's fine. It's fine. Go 
Christ, they're so tanky, my God. Wow. Oh, wow. Okay. Okay, it's not over. It's not over. Come on, Aloy, hurry up, please. Jesus. Okay, guys, I am a little bit lost. I'm not going to lie to you, but at least we found one of the stalkers. Shit. Guys, this is tense, man. All right, what's this? Okay, what's that? What's that? What is that? Okay, it said reinforce something, something. What is this? 20% resist ranged attacks. 34% resist freeze. All right, I'll think about it. Give me a, give me a moment. At least we got it now, so that's good. <laughs> I'm so nervous, guys. This is awful. All right. Doesn't seem to be any more. And what's this? Right, guys, it looks like the only way through is back where those stalkers were. So I need to, um, uh, I need to retrace my steps. Hey guys, okay, we're back here now. All right, one second. Oh, he hit! God damn it! Wait, there could be one to my left as well. <laughs> Guys, this is petrifying, man. Yeah, there's two. There's definitely two of them. Okay, wait, 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 wait. I can see the other one. Jesus. Oh, he died. Okay, thank goodness. Oh, shite. Okay. Oh, my God. Okay. Please say that's it. <laughs> Sorry, guys. This is, this is actually really tense, man. All right, I want to explore this. I just want to see what's down here. Maybe we'll be able to get there from this path. I don't know. Oh, check it out. Okay. All right, stuff. Dead end. But at least there's stuff. Wait, was there something up there? No, there isn't. Okay. Okay. Let me just take a normal potion. Okay. Right, what is here? Activate. Okay, let's do that. Here we go. Hopefully out of this cave. What is this? Right, we've been through there. I remember this actually. Okay, cool. Right, I think this is where the stalkers were originally um, prowling about.
Okay, there's a stalker trap. All right, I think we did it. So what I mean is we can now leave this area, I think. Okay, here we go. Done with the cave. So what's next on this path? Guys, this is gorgeous, man. Look at this. Wait. You can actually hear rumbling from that volcano. All right, anyway, let's press on. Oh, check it out. All right, which way? Okay, cool. So he wants me to go there. All right, check it out, guys. Holy crap, it's 36%. <laughs> I'll take it. That's awesome. All right, let's grab that. I don't understand. What do you, what do you mean? Oh, I see. I get it, guys. Oh, crap. I think that's... Oh, shit. Oh, shit. No, please. Oh, God damn it, guys. Am I stuck here? Oh, no, guys. You've got to be kidding. Wait, no, no. I can see handholds. Okay. Oh, sorry. That, that was really sucky, guys. I'm so sorry. Okay. Is anything here? Any enemies? What's that? What's that thing there? Blue gleam. I want it. <laughs> guys, check it out. So that's what blue gleam is. Oh, wow. Blue gleam is a rare and valuable resource traded to specialized merchants for extremely powerful weapons and armor. All right. Maybe it was actually a good thing that I fell down. All right. Let's get back up. I don't want to waste too much time, but that was awesome. At least I know they exist. <laughs> okay. We need to actually get here. Anything else is there? Oh, is that blue gleam? Hickman. Do I want that though? I probably do, but guys, let's just focus on this. Come on, come on. Right, I'll try and be a bit more careful now. So. Okay, it's actually fine to go on this, but I need to chill. Just wait. Just wait. <laughs> Alright, here we go. Oh, shit. <laughs> oh, phew. Okay. Alright, here we go. Where we go? Alright, this looks like a traversal puzzle. Right, pigment, and what's this? Supply crate. Okay, fine. Anything else? Oh, we can actually climb that. However... Now how do I cross this one? Down it is. Wait, hang on. Just before I do anything there, what what is this? Hey, Lloyd, don't get stuck, please. Oh, probably just for this. Okay, fine. Shit. <laughs> Nearly fell through there. Okay, anyway, let's keep going. Okay, what's that? Looks like I need to get up to that rope. All right, fine, fine. Anything else? Okay. Down, then up. Ah. 
All right, so let's go. The, let's go this way and grab that. So what are you? What is this? Pigment light oxide. Let's have a look, guys. Okay, cool. So that's fine. So let's have a look. Is there anything we can read? I like colored residue formed and on old wild metal. A pigment used for Banuke rock painting. Trade sets at Song's Edge for valuable rewards. Okay. Oh, we can't read up on it. Okay, fine. Just wondering. All right, so now what? Oh, okay, there's a ladder here. Okay. And then? I need to pull the rope to move this thing into position. Okay, the bridge is filling up. Oh, I see. Okay, cool. Excellent. So it takes me up there. I get it, guys. I get it. I don't want to miss anything, <laughs> especially uh, Blue Gleam. So what now? Do I go back here? Oh, crap. <laughs> okay. Phew. Okay, check it out. All right, supply crate, we'll grab that. Okay, so there's a rope that takes us back here. Oh, just a supply crate. Alright, just having a look. <laughs> just having a look. What's that? Okay, I can see something here we can climb. But why would I want to do that? Is there anything up here? Okay, it's going really high. I don't get it. Oh, wait, wait, wait. What's that? Oh, just for a supply. Okay, fine. Fine. All right, here we go. At least we're getting some goodies. Uh, do I go down here? It's gonna fall down. Jeez. Okay, here we go. No! Oh my god! <laughs> All right, here we go. I don't want to be too reckless, guys. Okay. Guys, this is taking forever to get to this place. But it's great. It's good exploration. But um, right. What's this? Okay. Another wind chime. Anything else? Oh, shite. Oh, gosh. Oh, no. Oh, no. What's this? What the hell is that? Morgan wasn't exaggerating. There's definitely something new out here, and I don't think it's friendly. Oh gosh, okay, boss fight guys. Okay, let me put Silent Hunter. That, whatever that thing was, it looks super intimidating. All right, sorry, where am I going? This way, all right. Oh, 
Oh, what's this? Okay, ritualistic marker again. Onward and upward. Okay. All right, let's keep going, guys. <laughs> Sorry, I'm just looking around in case that beast tries to mess with us. Where? Oh, uh, guys, I can hear one of those tower things. Alright, we gotta save it. <laughs> right, there's another tower. No, I don't wanna do that, I wanna save it. Okay, let's grab that. That. Resist freeze. Okay, you know what's coming, guys. It's probably gonna be a frost based enemy. However, in fact, just before I. Right, just before I actually do anything, let's see if we can scan this thing. And I'm going to stay in Silent Hunter for now. That thing's so freaky, guys. Great. Right, there's some grass, guys. Check it out. <laughs> so what do I do? Just jump down? I'm scared, but anyway, let's do it. <laughs> Whatever. Frost claw optional. No, we're going to fight it. We're going to fight it. <laughs> Holy crap. Guys, this thing looks amazing. Whatever it is. Okay. Um, Epsilon overrides. It's called a frost claw. A huge acquisition machine that circulates cryogenic fluids for its attacks and defensive capabilities. Despite its size, it is quick and deadly. Great. All right. Weakness to fire. Okay, hard eye. Okay, so okay, fine. Strength is freeze, obviously. Right, it's got freeze sacks. I wonder if we can blow those up. Perhaps it will freeze the actual. Okay, destroying this compound triggers a freeze explosion. Great. Inflicts a temporary brittle state. Yeah, yeah, I know all that. That's fine. And disables the freeze attack of the claws. What's this? Uh, destroying this component triggers a. F yes, yes, yes. And disables all freeze based attacks other than claws okay we'll we'll play by ear but i want to go for the if it's a chest or stomach i want to go for that right sparker blah, blah blah can be looted blah blah shooting this component with shock arrows will trigger an explosion electrifying anyone any sorry anything in the area i'll try but i don't know if i'll be able to do it but we'll try this i want to get the chest but before anything okay what's your path Where are you going, mate? <laughs> oh, crap. Oh, crap. I want to be kind of patient about this. I mean, I could shoot this, couldn't I? How do I get up here? Oh, uh, there's a thing. Okay, do not climb up, Aloy. All right, let me just watch what he's doing. Shit. <laughs> sorry. Sorry, I got scared, guys. Okay, they seem to get shocked whenever I do that, guys. Okay, we're going to switch to... <sighs> I need to calm down. My adrenaline's so high, guys. Okay. Oh, shit. I should have loaded up my arrows, but I didn't know. Come on, come on. Oh, shit. Okay, well, that worked. Big boy. 
Oh god, I'm scared, guys. I'm so scared. Okay. Okay, let's get our chest. What the? Whoa, what's he doing? Oh my god. Guys, I'm wearing a um, resist armor thing. Sorry, resist frost. Sorry, guys. I can't talk. I'm trying to concentrate. But I'm scared. <laughs> okay, I'm trying to get his chest. Oh, no. Okay, that stopped him. Oh, no. I'm... S no, please! This thing is terrifying, guys. <laughs> He's so fast. Shit. God damn it, I missed his shoulder. Oh, my God. Okay. 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 All right. He's powerful. He's really powerful, guys. Damn, I hear a plate. Oh, he keeps moving. My God. Okay. No, what's he doing? I hate when he does that. Okay, we need to be careful because that thing took a chunk out. Oh, no. Wait, wait, wait. Shit. Oh, no. Oh, my God. I need to get rid of that plate. It's getting in the way. All right, I kind of cocked that up. <laughs> All right. No, not there, not in his arm. Jeez. Wait, what's he doing? What's he doing? Oh my god. Was that a grab move, guys? Oh my god. Shit. Oh, Aloy, why didn't you shoot? Yes! Okay, here we go. No, leave me alone. Wait. <laughs> Sorry, guys. Wait, wait, wait. Okay, I want that. Shit. Oh, you're kidding me! Shit! <laughs> Help me, please! Oh my god. Okay, let's try and get a shoulder. Give me a shoulder. Oh my god, he moved. Okay, wait, wait. Oh, wait, is he frozen? Good. Okay, here we go, guys. Okay. Oh, we did it, guys. <laughs> we actually did it. Machine down. Now back to finding Araya. Which means we've got to climb. Guys, my palms are actually sweating. <laughs> it's crazy. This thing is so intimidating. Oh, I got one of these. Okay, good. Well, hey, that's our first uh, frost claw. No, he hits hard. He hits hard. And that was even despite me wearing um, a, res a resist freeze outfit. So, yeah, I need to kind of not underestimate them next time. Gosh, I'm out of breath, guys. <laughs> My adrenaline went up, man. It was it was crazy. Okay, I need some medicine. If there's any. 